Okay, today I'm going to divulge the secret of the no bunch waistband for knit skirts. And here is my beautiful finished county wool knit skirt. And I made the top of this skirt so that it goes just around my hips. But for the waistband, because I don't want any bulk, I took a pair of tights that I had, black tights, and whoops, there's the legs, and I cut the top off. And I'm going to use this top part for my waistband. Now you can see that this, of course, is nowhere near the size of my skirt. But you know, girls, the greatest invention ever made was Lycra spandex, because see what it can do? Now you may think that it's going to be impossible to put this little waistband on the size of this skirt. But if you look at my ironing board, I'm going to use the ironing board as a tool to stretch this waistband. So I'm going to slip it over the narrow end of the ironing board and I'm going to pull it all the ways up so it's perfectly stretched out as if it were on my waist. And then I'm going to take the skirt and I'm going to pull that up over the ironing board. But of course the skirt's wider so it's going to come up like this. And then what I'm going to do, because I want this skirt to fall at my hips, I'm not going to put it right up to the top of the waistband, so I'm going to pin it somewhat just below the waistband. And this is how I'm going to fit it on here. And I'm just going to go all around, and I'm going to take straight pins. I'll use the ones with the big yellow head so you can see them. And I'm going to pin each scallop around here. And then when I'm done doing this part, I'll take it off the ironing board and I'll flip it over and I'll pin the other part on. And then I will just hand sew these on to here. Or I may machine sew it, I'm not quite sure yet. And then when I stretch this out over my body, my skirt's going to fall from my hips without any gathering or any bunch. And that's the secret. So now if you tell anybody the secret, I'm going to have to kill you.